12 Commitment Report. Bill? Camp Republican challenges Billy Yao and Bill Flynn both say that they're more conservative than Howard Coble, and they're questioning Mr. Coble's voting record as well as his health. Failed government is not the solution to prosperity. Billy Yao says he blames the government for America's economic troubles. The only way we can do better than what we're doing is to change what we have in Washington. The Guilford County Commissioner says that change begins with replacing longtime incumbent Congressman Howard Coble. Yao says he thinks Coble's done a good job over the years, but says the 80 year old candidate is, quote, burned out. Yao also questions Coble's health. The 80 year old congressman has had a couple of health problems recently that raise some questions about his future. What is the comfort level of the folks out there that's going to vote? And, and who do they want to represent them? Do they want to take that chance and have the governor to appoint somebody? If, you know, things were not to go well for him, which I wish him no bad luck. The days of go along to get along Republicanism have kill, are killing us and they are dead. They must be gone. Absolutely have to be gone. Tea Party candidate Bill Flynn never mentions Coble by name during his campaign speech in Greensboro, but makes it clear he's referring to Coble in an interview with WXI 12 News, noting the differences between himself and the incumbent. I think people can call themselves conservatives very easily, but really, what do they believe and what is their what is their agenda? The former radio personality says his proof comes from Coble's voting record. The current congressman out of 35 debt ceiling increases has voted yes on that 19 times. That's not a conservative uh, you know, way of handling things. What is conservative, or more importantly in this race, who is the most conservative candidate? I think that I would be defined as the most conservative. Are you the most conservative candidate in this race? I, I would uh, certainly default to the, the voter's judgment on that. But well, you're you're opinion, in my opinion, yeah. Bill Flynn's never voted for nothing. On the campaign trail, Flynn and Yao are appealing to voters on the far right. Both candidates warn voters that socialism is taking over the country. This is hand-to-hand -hand combat politically. We have Marxists and leftists leading the Democrat Party. The federal government ideologically would love to see all of us fall off the cliff because then they could socialize America and they could put us all in a status that we were all equal. Folks, we're not equal. We're the elite. We're the business owners. We're America's creators. And here's a list of the candidates running in the 6th District. Howard Coble, the incumbent, Billy Yao, as well as Bill Flynn, and Tony Forrest, the only Democrat in this room.